Tensions between NATO and Russia are on the rise following a spike in Russian Air Force activity in Eastern Europe and its troop movements close to Ukraine's border. At a joint meeting with the EU's new foreign chief, NATO Secretary General Jen Stoltenberg said recent Russian behavior was unacceptable. Russia continues to uh, support the separatists by training them, by providing equipment, and uh, uh, supporting them also by uh, having special forces, Russian special forces, inside uh, the eastern parts of uh, Ukraine. The recent Russian air activity, while keeping to international airspace over the Baltic and North Seas, has flirted close to airspace borders. What you saw this past week was a, was a larger, more complex formation of aircraft carrying out a little deeper uh, and I would, I would say a little bit more provocative uh, flight path. For its part, Russia has expressed its own concerns over NATO enlargement and its reinforcement of troops in Eastern Europe. Although NATO says the alliance is not back on Cold War terms with its former enemy, it believes Russian behavior is undermining trust built up over decades.